there are 500 species of carpenter bee found around the world. They get their name from the way that they build their nests in wood. They look quite similar and are often confused with bumblebees. The difference between bumblebees and carpenter bees is that bumblebees nest in the ground, whereas carpenter bees will nest in wood. Carpenter bees will have a shiny and hairless abdomen, whereas bumblebees have a hairy abdomen. They were first described in 1802 by Pierre André Lettre, the French entomologist. Did you know that the name carpenter bee comes from the ancient Greek word for woodcutter? Carpenter bees have large compounded eyes. They are solitary bees, although there are some species that create simple solitary nests for themselves, where the females may inhabit. Where the females do share a nest, they will quite often share the work between them, with one guarding the nest and others foraging. They are able to tunnel into wood by vibrating their bodies as they wrap their mandibles against the wood. Each nest has one entrance, which has different tunnels running off it. The tunnels they build are a perfect circle which measures about 16 millimetres. They will tend to tunnel through tree limbs and other man-made structures such as beams, furniture and joists. Because of their ability to tunnel into items that humans use, such as beams, joists, floorboards and furniture, they are considered a pest by many. When they tunnel through the wood, they do not eat it, but instead will discard it or use it to build cell partitions in the nest. They use the tunnels that they build as a place to bring up their young or simply as a place to store pollen or nectar. Carpenter bees will hibernate during the colder months inside their tunnels and will emerge in springtime. They are very good at pollinating, which is when they land on flowers and vibrate their thoracic muscles to loosen up the pollen. This makes them very useful for humans. They are first seen around April and May of each year. Did you know that male carpenter bees don't sting? Female carpenter bees will not sting unless they are provoked and will only do so in self-defence, such as if you try to trap them in your hands. Female carpenter bees build the nests in which to lay their eggs, but they prefer to use old nests rather than new make new ones. Female carpenter bees lay their eggs in their nests and then they die, leaving their young to grow and develop on their own. Newly developed adult carpenter bees emerge in August, feed on nectar and return to the tunnels to overwinter.